Hello everyone, it's Big Bear. Welcome to my channel and today I'm bringing you my new table for Black Myth Wukong. This is the third video. This table is basically the same with the one that I uh, just uploaded I think last week. But uh, I removed two scripts because they're not working as intended and I don't really like how the way they work. Uh, but don't worry, I replaced the function of both of them in a new script I added in. Okay, so this video most likely about that script only. The rest should stay the same. So let's start with downloading the table. After you download the table, you're gonna see only one open it and you're gonna see one script over here like that. Uh, open the script. Okay, then you're gonna see my information about who made the table, whatever. Uh, next is my general promotional link. Uh, you just activate it. And then they're gonna link you to my channel. And if you like this content, please give me a subscribe. Thank you for that. Now, if you don't wanna see that thing anymore, you just move the master script out of it like this, okay? But I would just keep it here again, just to promoting my promoting promoting my channel. Anyway, we're gonna go to the master script now. Activate that. Wait a little bit. It activate everything uh, for you know, for the JIT engine to run around doing all the script and everything repairing for ready for you to do everything in here so again the experience and spot part are staying the same the damage control staying the same player controller staying the same this part that down here most of them staying the same the, uh, the experience multiplier is there in finite relic point in finite item no skill cooldown these two extra script made by our expert i should keep it here um we don't really i don't really need this anymore but well if you if you like them or, or unless they ask me to remove it then i will otherwise this one right here can replace both of these okay so let's start with this one because this video is all about it let's uh let me load in my game first all right so now Let's activate a custom script. So again, whenever this script working by whenever like the wheel, your money drop, it's gonna replace this for the item that you put over here. Okay. So when you double click on that one right there, double click on that, you're gonna see something like a drop list, like a small window with a drop list like this, and you can see all the item that you need in here, most of them. All right, you can type in there. Uh, you can even have curio, or you can have relics, you can have, I don't think I add uh, the spirit in here. But anyway, you can have almost everything in the game's adding. So let's say I want to get the new uh, curio. So let me see, curio, I'm just searching here, curio, and I forgot to add that thing in. My bad. There we go. Sorry, looking for that. So up accessory limit is the one that increase your curio over here okay so now uh when when this script activated my will will not increase but instead it's going to replace this with the item that you put over here all right so let there's nothing here ah yeah there's a monster over here i'm gonna come and hit them oh don't kill that don't kill that okay and you can see my curio going far See that? I usually have three, now I have four. Okay, let's try to get one more. And now I have five. I think five is the, uh, the limit, so you cannot have any one more than that. Okay, so that one of them. Now next, we're gonna looking for some item that I don't see them in the, the games. They don't even have a name, but they are here. So let me show you. So we're gonna go to this one, 300 plus attack pill. This one you can only hang it once. You, it will not add in more. Uh, I don't know what the hell is this item. <laughs> but it will. So check that my attack is like 70 right now. I'll hit this guy. And now my attack is 300. 
70 okay so there's some like hidden item again they don't even have the name in the in the item list but anyway uh when you want to change something just double click on that script and this thing gonna open up okay and you can choose whatever so let me show you some interesting thing um let's say some people were saying that they missing some of the curio over here so uh i don't have a legendary item here i think you need to find some bosses with a froggy thing to get that um what is that? I forgot what it's called already. Let's just try with something simple, okay? Uh, thunderstone. I don't, have, I don't think I have a thunderstone in this group right here. Yeah, I don't have one. Okay, so let me try to find a wheel drop. Let's kill this one. Okay, and let's hit this guy. Ah. Thunderstone Curio Drop And now we have, where is it, Thunderstone right here As similar to that, we can do something else Some people were asking me like how can they find all of the, uh, of the seed And as you can see over here, we had the list of seed Where is that, right here all 15 seeds are in here so you can just get them all drop just by killing monster changing and keep changing the id the item id all right um what else huh what else do we looking for if you're looking for some like item for crafting you can just change this one to whatever item that you need and kill some monster and it will drop right away for you um Relic is something interesting. This one might crash your game if you don't uh, use it carefully. So always make sure that you uh, have a copy of your set before you try this, okay? So for the Relic, I'm gonna try open them one by one. Now we have three and ready, so let's add two more. How do I add some more? All right here. So we have the eye, the ear, the nose now let's get the tongue okay get them by the sequence is my recommendation to avoid any weird glitch and stuff that bug your game and crash your game whatever okay so I'm gonna get hit this guy and now you see what is this right here we see the tongue okay the relic I'm gonna add this, I'm gonna change this one, next one, I'm gonna to wanna to get the body, okay? So hit this guy, and you can see, I don't have any will, but I get new relic here, grip body. All right, then next, I'm gonna change it to the free my, the sixth one, the hidden one in here. Be careful when you do this, I'm not sure if this is going to affect in your uh, games how much, okay? But just want to show you how powerful this script is. Now we have this one, as you can see, it's still locked, right? You don't, it, like, you cannot really add any talent in here, okay? We open the next one, unlock uh, legacy, uh, unlock legacy talent, it's just right below the, um, the free mind, see that? the inf they in the auto already okay so this one right here and then I'm gonna try to find let's see I'm gonna try to hit something and kill everything here okay let's reset this guy ta 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 Sleep. All right. Let me double check that it's not unlocking thing. Yes. Yeah, so the free mind still lock right because we didn't unlock the legacy talent yet. Get over here. Q one and go over here and see the magic. Now it unlock. Right. Okay, and you can use this one with the infinite relic part to unlock everything. 
Ah, oh, come on. I'm not really good with the mouse and keyboard playing this game. So when you use it with the infinite relic point, you can basically unlock everything. Just like this. What happened to me is that I believe that after I unlock this, it crashed my game, but when I come back, I uh, think was safe. So I'm gonna try to show you how this thing works. Ah. Leave me alone. Let me see what else. Uh, it can drop any other item, okay? So let's see. I think one of my friends was asking me, like, it kind of cracking something, but. Oh, let's say this one, Celestial Pill. Alright, you see my pills over here. No, this one will not show you anything, but this one I'm gonna show something. Like this, for example, Celestial J lost a pill, something. My HP around 600, and this one is in 3 yeah. HP. And there we go. Now we have the pure. And this thing gonna permanently add it to your game file. So once you have it, you cannot remove it. Okay, keep that in mind. Okay, get in here. Rest. Let's save the games. And let me see, I believe when I try to quit, it crash my games. Be patient, be patient. Oh, it's not crashing my games. That's good. Okay. Let's see if we have everything safe. So, as you can see, I still have my relic over here. I still have my stat. You can see that my stat over here increased. Um, anyway, that's it for this video. Hopefully, this is going to help. And if you like it, again, give me a subscribe. I will see you later.